job is I'm a space scientist. I'm a space physicist. Uh, I work at a university and the job of my group is to build pieces of instrumentation that we launch into space. I am a researcher at the Institute of Sound and Vibration Research. I'm Harry McVeigh. I am the singer and guitarist in White Lies, which I've been doing for about 10 years. I'm on the Rolls-Royce Electrical uh, Engineering Grad Scheme and I work in the Innovation Hub. We look at how can we improve our uh, technologies, particularly in aerospace. So Annabelle would like to know what's the most interesting case that you've worked on. I think it would be impossible for me to pick the most exciting one. I mean, in my career I've stolen people, um, gold bars, helicopters, I've broken into banks, stolen millions of pounds from them, all sorts of crazy things. But as human beings, as, as long as we've been looking up into the sky, we've been wondering how we might be able to get there. It was a story written by um, an English bishop scientist, uh, uh, Bishop Francis Godwin in the 1600s, and he imagined a trip to the moon where you'd get geese. I always wondered what happened to those geese. <laughs> Lo and behold, we managed to find one. They think. live with Suzu. <laughs> Do you want to tell the students some of the, the projects that you've worked on? The Angry Birds cartoons. Then I worked on the Monster High uh, movie, Shaun the Sheep, for TV and um, for Farmageddon, which was the feature film. And then I worked briefly on Early Man as well. I've been reporting on technology actually since 1995. And what we want to do today is really ask you to start thinking about how you might construct, design or imagine the next world of gaming. Uh, there were some amazing projects and we were all so impressed. The amount of work that you've done in the last two days compared to what I've done is amazing. <laughs> Keep those imaginations working in the way that they are because you guys, are, I'm so impressed. I'm looking forward to working with you all in the future.